Well, howdy there, internet people. It's Brian again, and welcome to The Roads. This is Driving Dates, a series where we discuss dates that drive history forward. And today is September 3rd. And starting off in 1783, the Treaty of Paris was signed between the United States and Great Britain. It officially ended the Revolutionary War and recognized the colonies as independent. Next, in 1838, Frederick Douglass made his second attempt at escape. He was dressed as a free black sailor. He would successfully board a moving train and would later arrive safely in New York. In 1916, President Woodrow Wilson signed the Adamson Act into law. In order to avoid strikes for the railroads, the act was signed, making the workdays eight hours long. In 1939, the German submarine U-30 sank the British passenger ship SS Athena. This was the first British ship to be sunk during World War II, and resulted in the loss of 117 passengers. At the same time, in 1939, the UK declared war on Germany. In 1953, Convention for the Protection of Human Rights and Fundamental Freedoms entered into force. And in 1964, President Lyndon B. Johnson signed the Wilderness Act into law. This act would protect over 9 million acres of land and establish the definition of wilderness. In 1979, the White House Plumbers broke into the psychiatrist's office. This event would later feature in the Watergate scandal. In 1995, eBay was founded. And finally, the quote of the day is, Power concedes nothing without a demand. It never did, and it never will. Find out just what any people will quietly submit to, and you have found out the exact measure of injustice and wrong which will be imposed upon them attributed to Frederick Douglass. And that's all we have to date for this date. Y'all have a good day.